Hey guys, it's Davin here at brewbits.com. Now on a lot of my videos, you will see me when I'm making a beer or a wine or something like that. I will tell you that I've taken a sample in my trial jar for a reading, so we uh, get a reading with my hydrometer. But the question is, how do I get the sample into my trial jar? Well, a long time ago, I used to use one of these, which is a siphon, and I'd pop it down in and I'll suck on the end, quickly pop my thumb over, and then try and get it all in, and they might have to take a couple options on it. And then this little beauty came to me. This is a, a glass wine thief, very pretty little thing. And you dunk that in and put your thumb on the end and release it. it takes a little bit of a time for this one, but they're very, very good, very, very useful. But now I use this. Now, yes, some of you may recognize it as being a turkey baster. This, I prefer to be called a large pipette. Um, and uh, it's never, ever seen a turkey. So how do I do it? So here I've got a ginger cider brewing away. So I'm just gonna take a sample in there and then gently pour it down the side. And then gonna go for a second one. And it takes a few of these, but you can see it's really easy and really pretty darn quick. Dee, 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 dee. You can get bigger ones of these if you want a bigger one. And there we go. I can now read off my SG, which is coming out at uh, 1.0. 024. So this ginger side has got a little bit of way to go. So I'm going to pop the lid back on and pop that into my warm cupboard. However, this is my little trick. It's a turkey baster, large pipette. You'll find them on their website. Um, I'll put a link uh, in the comments or possibly somewhere up there. Um, and then you can go find it and uh, you'll find it really, really easy to take a sample and fill your trial jar. So for now, happy brewing. See you next time.